girls on the train. The bride, with her short veil attached to a tiara decorated with a tiny penis that we hope in a moment of solidarity is not to scale. Her friends, best friend, BBF comb crew, surround her in a public car. They talk loudly of resting bitch face, making the face, new bras poking each other in the breasts, and the cost of grocery bags up 5p to 10p if you want a really good bag and they agree that they really wanted a good bag possibly with an attractive designer logo. Peals of laughter over the bras and the bags. They declared to us the hapless fellow passengers they haven't even begun to drink. They were already drunk on now on what lay ahead the speed of the train. True story, um, but it wasn't a train, it was a bus. And I was traveling down from the park, uh, Guerrillo Park, down to, down, to, down to the main drag in Barcelona. And it was, it was these young girls, there were about seven of them, and um, they were all standing on the bus. I was standing on the bus and the rest of the group, my mother included, was over sitting because they were a little older. And these young ladies were hilarious. They were so funny and they were, they were so into what, the, they were so enthusiastic and into what they were doing. Barcelona was warm. London was probably very cold at the time. And I loved their energy and they were just howling with laughter. And you know, all of the little old people sitting on the bus were not happy with them because they were being too loud and too enthusiastic. I thought they were wonderful. So our stop was before theirs and they call out, you know, OAT, everybody off the bus. And that one of the young ladies commented, she says, oh my God, all you old people off the bus. And I start to get off. <laughs> and she looks at me, she says, no, 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 not you, not you, you're okay. So I appreciated the shout out and I hope that they had um, a lovely girls weekend out. And I certainly hope that the bride's tiara was not to scale.